saw uh, the Deputy Secretary General spoke, and uh, it was a statement uh, which came through the press briefing, and we should respect that. Do you agree that it is lawlessness for those that have continued to misuse you know, the name of ECL on number plates, and, and, and many of these are, co are coming from the PF? Uh, it will be an uh, insubordination for me to discuss uh, uh, my boss's statement. Do you imagine this ending? Yeah. Um, of course, the, the, the Deputy Secretary General, uh, sh uh, she's uh, one of the, the senior uh, members of our beloved party, uh, Patriotic Front. Um, uh, so a statement, all of us, we have to take it seriously because it is coming from the office of the Secretary General. Are you concerned that she raises issues of lawlessness amidst the pandemic and how politicians have been handling, you know, rallies and, and, and all of these things that are coming with, with an election? What is your impression of her statement regards you breaking the law and having to call for your arrest? Again, um, that is a statement from my, my, my boss. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, Deputy Secretary General of the party, and uh, uh, what can I, uh, the only thing which I can say is that um, as government of His Excellency Edgar uh, Chagualungu, President and Commander in Chief of Defence Force, uh, we do respect uh, the law. President Edgar Chagualungu is a law abiding president and uh, is a custodian of our constitution. I can assure you that um, all of us, Zambians, there is no one above the law. That's why we do respect the, 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 the judiciary of this country. We do respect police and um, any other uh, institution of government and other institutions. So, Honorable, you so then you agree... What I'm trying to say here is that uh, uh, as government workers, mm. we do work every day. And working every day, definitely we do uh, meet or mingle with the Zambian people. And uh, for, 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 for me and uh, many others, our job is to mingle with people. Uh, so, that's so, so why, you, you do agree that's that, why, that, that, that's that why, somehow that's you, you why, that, have been breaking the that, law that's why, organizing huge crowds? That's why the issue to do with the five golden laws mm. from the uh, Ministry of Health and uh, the Public Health Act, we do uh, follow in many fora. And if you can go back a, a little bit, uh, Chesu, and uh, viewers out there, you will agree with me that... Uh, uh, we have been uh, so committed uh, uh, to the fight against COVID-19. We have been how uh, uh, you have seen how we have been working, uh, not only here uh, in Lusaka, but uh, even in our constituencies, to sensitise our people on the dangers of this pandemic of COVID-19. Uh, but with the, with, but the, with, with a statement coming from the PF Deputy Secretary General, does this make you? Uh, worried and concerned that you will no longer have to mobilize in a manner that you have been. I mean, she, you know, single-handedly picked you out as well as Brian Mshimba for having breaking the law. Are you going to continue to organize and to to mobilize in the manner that you have? Um, I thank you very much. Um, you know, um, the benefits of hard work of His Excellency Edgar Chagualung. People out there, they're very excited to see any individual who's associated to His Excellency Edgar Chagalung because of the hard work of His Excellency Edgar Chagalung. We don't call people. We don't call people. They just uh, follow us because of the Kila money. Which that, money? The money that is, is, is been, no. The money that you have which one? been... I'll give you an example of mm. the 300,000 kwacha that mm. you gave out recently for the marketeers. To, to, to where? In your constituency. And you have seen that money in my constituency. 
well, at least you've seen it over the media that you have indeed so been dishing back, out all this you'll money. You'll go back to go to Kabush constraints. Does this worry? Does this not worry you that there's a lot of people that are going to raise eyebrows around money that will all of a sudden no. come out for marketeers no. in the name of empowerment? And, and I think that that's how, what one how? of the questions that Elizabeth no. feels that you you've been hiding in the name of the president that look this here. is money for empowerment. And look it, here. doesn't it come out at a long time? We have money as constituencies. Mm. We have money as constituencies. We get money for development in each and every constituency. Nanguku Southern Province, Bajak Mumbu, Barasenda. constituency development funds. Okay? So, if we part of this money to allow market here. So how do we know that this is CDF fund and uh, this is not? Because, 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 the, because, because, because the argument is that well, uh, I gave the most of the members of parliament, especially uh, those that are coming from uh, the opposition, feel uh, that look, this city, some of these CDF funds have not been fairly distributed. How? So how are you not? How are you getting your money? Born uh, to to pay them here. Mm. All of us we get that money. All of us we get that money. All of us we get that money. Okay? All of us we get that money. So Why don't we see this money, Honorable Minister, from, from those, especially from the opposition that cry foul, that you know, ministers that are in government will always have to dish out and flush no, out this money. I think that that has been the biggest concern. I just want to know why we do not see this money from the opposition. Look at this the um, Constituency Development Funds, all of us will get that money. All of us will get that money. Independent member of parliaments, uh, opposition member of parliaments, and the members of parliaments from the ruling party, we get that money. And that's the money which we use in our constituents. That's the money which we use in our constituents. So, if you can see the two colors, mm. okay, one from Matero, another one from uh, Lusaka, we need people from Kabush Constituency no, to call we, us. We will have people no, from Kabush because course. obviously you have, you have quite, no. quite some time on the phone. So now we should have Felix Kabush. Mm. Social media. Let's hear, maybe, maybe Banda mm. Justin is, is from Kabushi. Banda, good evening. You well, flew to Diamond Banda. Life. <laughs> Hello, Justin. Uh, are you there? Yes, I'm there. Please go ahead quickly with your comment or question. Yes, please. I just want to find out. I, w I would want to meet with the vulnerable. Actually, yes. Yes, I'm there. Go ahead. Yes, vulnerable Lusambo. I just want to meet you in person. I don't know what time I can see you. Uh, what is the, your question or contribution? I, I think that, that's, that that is what this platform, uh, Justin, is for. Okay. 